Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Coming back to you with another Say Thomas slash crypto video. I want y'all to hit that thumbs up button, that like, subscribe, notification bell, all of that good stuff. Okay, so this video can get out into the algorithm. Remember y'all, the more eyes that are on my videos, the more eyes that I want to say Tama and all my other educational content. All right, now also if you're interested in Patreon, links will be in the description and in the comments. All right, so uh, we look at Saitama right now. Saitama is having some positive price action. Now it is up from three zeros uh, one to three zeros five. So it has been having some positive uptrend, okay, uh, in the down market. And if we look at the market, all right, uh, the market is still um, where it was when Saitama was at three zeros uh, six one, okay? Uh, we look at the fear and greed fear and greed we're still at 35 uh in the fear okay and if we look at bitcoin bitcoin has actually went down uh, a little bit more okay um uh you know since say tama has went to the three zeros five uh six five all right so we're talking about three zero six one to three zero six five and the market is still uh where it was if not worse okay so that is a good thing when we look at what Saitama is doing right now uh, by staying in the green. All right, and that also says that you have individuals right now that are having a lot more uh, trust in Saitama, not just the Saitama investors, but investors out there that are looking for a project, okay, to park uh, some funds in, to uh, kind of have, uh, you know, their wealth hold some value some kind of way rather than just uh, put it into the stable coins and have it sit there because we know that when you put it into the stable coins It's just sitting there. It's not really getting any kind of value like that. You might as well just put uh, You know, it's kind of like equivalent of just sitting your money into uh, a savings account. All right, so this is why uh, You know you get some individuals or some investors that do not like putting their money into Okay, the stable coins like this right here. All right uh, you know, back in the back when I first started uh, investing, that was the move right there. Individuals, okay, when the market was down, investors would put their money into Tether, okay, or they'll put it into USD coin, or they'll put it into any of these dollar uh, stable coins right here, okay, uh, that we're looking at. Some of them will risk it and put it into Litecoin, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. Uh, mostly Litecoin because we know that Bitcoin was driving a market so people weren't trying to lose too much money uh, back in the day Litecoin actually held its value Litecoin was a top three OG it was always Bitcoin Ethereum and Litecoin all right and that's what individuals would do um, but uh, very rarely did a lot of individuals stay on that trend they always went to uh, you know the stable coins Binance USD uh, USDT tether those were the, the uh, two big ones all right but nowadays people are taking m much more of a risk okay they're looking for uh, the Saitamas okay uh, let me get my charger because I don't want my uh, phone I said phone I don't want my um, laptop to go out okay so we got that plugged up so we look at Saitama, now individuals are looking for projects uh, like Saitama, okay? Some of these are projects um, that is holding some value. And we look at Saitama and the value that it is holding, okay, um, you know, with that 3061 to 3065, they're looking at a, a good amount of breathing room right there. This is why a lot of individuals, some individuals are putting, uh, or resting their, uh, their funds in here because say Tama right now is not up um, a lot, but it's not up by a little. All right, when you see 3061 and you see 3065, people are looking at what's in between. Okay, two, three, four, uh, five. They're looking at that. I'm just trying to give you, I know some people may think, oh, I don't, this is crazy what he's talking about, but I'm telling you how individuals looked at crypto and how some of them still look at crypto based on, you know, conversations. Uh, and based on, uh, you know, uh, investing strategy conversations when it comes to crypto that I've had throughout my uh, nine years of investing in crypto. And some of the individuals out there still look at crypto this way. They're looking at the breathing room, okay? They don't care about 
they, they care a little bit about the prices, but they care about that breathing room, all right? So uh, when we look at Saitama, Saitama is good in the green, okay? And we look at the market, we're hoping that the market can rebound, okay? Uh, but the thing is, um, we have to prepare for this round, y'all, because remember, we are still in the beginning stages. We are still in the uh, adjusting stages of this market right now, okay? So, um, I'm not saying that it is going to end anytime soon, but I'm also not saying I'm also not saying it, it is here to stay. All right, uh, right now crypto is the most unpredictable that I have seen, and I'm pretty sure any in in, in uh, experienced investors will tell you the same thing. Well, at least experienced investors who have been investing uh, for the, la the the last nine years. I had someone ask me, okay, is this the worst bear market I've seen? and you will be shocked the answer is no this is not the worst bear market um uh, this is not the worst um uh, market <clears throat> that i have seen in my nine years i've seen a market worse than this okay so uh, i'm just telling you that based on my nine years of experience okay uh based on a lot of notes i've written down and a, a, a lot of knowledge that i have up here there's nothing like maintaining knowledge in the brain uh, after, you know, um, uh, having those years of experience, okay, and certain running, certain being in certain markets. So no, this is not the worst market uh, um, I've seen. This is not the worst bear market I've seen. Okay, I've seen worse than this. This is probably the second worst that I've seen, but it's not worse than uh, some that I've seen uh, years back. Okay, so um, you know, take take with that what you will. Okay. Um, and you know like i said y'all just because of my experience and what i know what to expect uh that has put my mind at ease it has given me a peace of mind knowing that one day this this market will rebound okay just like past bear markets have all right so um look y'all i wanted to uh make this video leave y'all with some positivity i know it's a lot of negativity out there you know um and if it's not anyone leaving negativity, it's someone just trying to push cryptos that are still going to get you nowhere, which means that you are going to be investing money in uh, uh, crappy projects that are not going to go anywhere. And these are projects also that the people that are telling you uh, to invest in, they already have a higher position in, in those projects uh, uh, way before. Uh, a lot of these projects uh, hit the market. A lot of these people are heavily invested. A lot of these people know these uh, developers, if you want to call them that. I, in my opinion, they're not true uh, developers, okay? Anyone can make a, a damn crypto uh, nowadays. They're not true uh, developers. They are uh, uh, buddies of a lot of these, uh, you know, of a lot of these uh, influencers out here who was saying, hey, bro, you know, I just made a, uh, a project. I got a project going. Uh, do you want to pour into this project before, okay, it hits the market, okay? Um, and, of course, when it hits the market, okay, those individuals are going to see, those influencers, those big bag holders that already have access, they are going to see, okay, some returns, and they're going to take, it, take the, uh, the returns out uh, uh, quickly. And one of the reasons why they're not going to let their money sit is because they've already got wind of what kind of project this is. They already know who's behind it. They've already had discussions with a lot of these individuals. And when you come in, uh, come along and put your hard-earned money into uh, a lot of these projects, you're going to miss out because no sooner you put your money in, uh, a few hours later, a day, a day later, sometimes it, it don't even make it past two days. All right, and sorry, I know I'm going on a rant, but I'm only telling you this to, to properly educate individuals so you will not be looking uh, insane, okay, when a project comes out and you want to put your hundred bucks in and you think that, okay, your hundred bucks is going to a moon, you're going to be a millionaire. No, this is a game that individuals play with you and your money, okay? They're playing games with you. So um, I'm just here to properly educate individuals, okay, so you can be on the up and up. The best thing that I, I do right now is I look for the best blue collar cryptos to get into because I know that, um, you know, this the blue collar space is what uh, Capitol Hill is talking about. Uh, the blue collar space is what's going to uh, overtake uh, certain systems that we depend on to, to live in this uh, crazy ecosystem of a world. 
all right and uh, right now we're going into new newer technology and um, some of the best ways that you're going to get rich and wealthy okay is to through investing in, into uh, uh, newer technology okay whether it be startup tech startups or uh, crypto technology all right so um, yeah, yeah I wanted to get, give y'all this video I hope y'all found this video um, uh, very educational all right and um, remember y'all every now okay will be history tomorrow why do I say that? I say that because that's what my nine years have shown me. It's not just some bull crap I'm pulling out of my hat. I'm just telling you what my nine years have shown me. Uh, and nine years are gone. Can you imagine what I've seen in nine years? And can you imagine what I have invested in uh, in nine years? Okay? Can you imagine that? And that's gone now. Okay? And so today will be gone tomorrow. All right? So... Um, you know, remember, every now will be history tomorrow, and you either have patience in this crypto investing space, or you lose in the end. Uh, and the thing is, you don't want to be a loser because I want all of you beautiful people out there and supporters to be winners. Okay, I think all of us deserve to have uh, generational wealth and financial freedom. Okay, but you have to want it also for uh, your family. You have to want it, uh, yeah, just not for yourself, but for your family and your future unborn loved ones also. All right. So this is my video. Um, yeah, this was supposed to be a short video. Y'all know when I get on here, I can uh, talk. Okay, but um, uh, yeah, this is my video, and I will catch all of you beautiful people and supporters on the up and up. Y'all enjoy the rest of your day. Howdy.